hey guys assalamu alaikum it's me talha and in this quick video tutorial i'm going to be sharing with you a model in place hack in revit which you guys probably didn't know this hack helps you place lighting fixtures on the geometries created using model in place but before i started i would like to let you know about my website where you can get my revit interior courses if you are interested you can just follow the first link in the description anyway let's get started so you guys know that whenever we try to create a new model in place we get this dialog box and we usually choose generic models from these families uh, from this category list now let's try to place a lighting fixture on a geometry created in the generic models category let's close this and if i move here you can see i have already opened this project which i modeled in one of my previous videos and if you if you guys remember i created this facade design using model in place and i created this in uh, generic models category now let's try to place a lighting fixture on this uh, on this extrusion here so i will go here select component and this pendant light is selected so let's try to place that you can see it's not working Revit is not allowing us to place that uh, on this extrusion if I try to place the same component on the ceiling you can see it's allowing us to place this on the ceiling but if I try the same thing with this extrusion we cannot do that now I will show you how you can fix that let's select the extrusion edit in place and open up the family category and parameters and you can see we got the same dialog box which we get when we try to create the model in place and right now you can see generic models is selected here you just need to change this from the generic models category to ceilings only by doing the change in this uh, family category we will be able to place the lighting fixture on the any kind of geometries we create using model in place so let's try that let's click ok finish model and select component again and there you go we can now easily place this lighting fixture on this extrusion let's try another component so we'll go here and load a new family uh, let's use this one okay it's already loaded i think so i will uh, just search that here here we have it you can see we can easily place this lighting component uh, on this extrusion now i will show you another example of this I created this rendering using Revit and Inkscape and if I zoom in here you can see I placed all these lighting fixtures using the same method I just created this swimming pool walls uh, in the ceiling category and I, I was able to place the ceiling lights uh, on the uh, on these walls here so this way you can place any kind of uh, lighting fixtures to any kind of geometries you create using model in place you just need to select the ceiling from this uh, category list now another thing which i wanted to share with you is about the walls category if i go here you can see i have created these two walls or the geometries here this one i created in the generic models category let's try to place a door here you can see revit is not allowing us to do that now let's try to place the door on this one you can see we are now able to place the door on this geometry so the only difference between these two is that i created this one in the generic models you can see that here and this one i created in the walls category so these were the quick tips i wanted to share with you guys i hope you have learned something new so please make sure to like and share this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already don't forget to turn on the post notifications and don't forget to check out my interior courses you can follow the first link in the description and yeah see you guys in the next video